yes students today i will tell you some numericals about series and parallel combination of the electrical resistances so you know the formula uh, for series combination and parallel combination of the resistances in series combination resultant resistance r1 is the sum of direct sum of resistances r1 r2 plus r3 plus so on number 1 number 2 you know that in parallel combination we add r as a reverse resultant is r so 1 by r is equal to 1 by r1 plus 1 by r2 plus so on this is equation number 2 now i have told you that when you connect the resistance equal resistance in parallels two equal resistances when connected in parallels the resultant becomes half the value of resistance resultant resistance is half suppose the there are two resistances of 4 ohms so 1 by r is equal to 1 by 4 plus 1 by 4 this becomes 2 by 4 so r is equal to 4 by 2 is equal to 2 so this the r1 is 4 r2 is 4 so resultant r is 2 halves aadha ho jata hai and one thing more if you connect many resistances in parallel the resultant resistance will have the value less than the value of the smallest resistance connected let there are four resistances you connect 1 by r is equal to 1 by 5 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 3 and plus 1 by 2 when you get the value of these are resistances 5 ohm 4 ohm 3 ohm 2 ohms the so value of r and you will find the value of r this will this will be less than 2 ohms यानी जो सबसे छोटा रेजिस्टेंस है उससे भी इसकी वैल्यू कम होगी दीज टू थिंग्स शुड बी रिमेंबर सो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट कनेक्ट थ्री रेजिस्टेंसेस ऑफ सिक्स ओम्स सच दैट द रेजल्टेंट इज नंबर वन देर आर थ्री रेजिस्टेंसेस आर वन इज इक्वल टू सिक्स आर टू इज इक्वल टू सिक्स एंड आर थ्री इज इक्वल टू सिक्स नाई नाउ यू हैव टू कनेक्ट देम in such a way that number 1 number 1 r is equal to 9 ohms and number 2 r is equal to 4 ohms you have to connect the three resistances in such a way that resultant is 9 ohm 4 ohm now you see let let you connect all in parallel so what will you get you will get 1 by 6 1 by 6 1 by 6 3 by 6 so r will be 1/3 1 by r is equal to 1 by 6 plus 1 by 6 plus 1 by 6 this becomes 3 by 6 so so r is equal to 6 by 3 is equal to 2 2 ohms 
and you will when you connect them all them in series you will get 6 plus 6 plus 6 in series in parallel a series the r is equal to 18 ohms now you have to get you have to connect in such a way aapko aise jodna hai tino resistance ko ki resultant 9 ohm hai when you get how will you connect that resultant is 9 ohm so you try you, you see that when you connect in series it is 18 ohm when you connect in parallel it gets 2 ohms so think of a combination when two resistances are connected in parallel the value becomes half so 6 6 first two you connect them in parallel the value will be 3 ohms and in parallel and then you connect 6 ohms in series you will get 9 ohm in this way general formula result uh, resistances connected in parallel the value becomes half two equal resistances when connected in parallel the value becomes half this is 6 ohm this is 6 ohm so this value this will become half 3 ohm now if you connect third resistance here 6 ohms then value becomes 3 plus 6 A, B, C. A or B ke beech mein, between A and B, two resistances are connected in parallel. In general, you know the value becomes half, 6 by 2, 3. You can find out 1 by R is equal to 1 by 6 plus 1 by 6 is equal to 2 by 6. So, R is equal to 3. This is 3. And then again, in series this is 6 so total r r is equal to this 3 plus this 6 is equal to 9 ohm in this way you get the first question solved r is equal to 9 ohm understand now second one you have to connect these three resistances in such a way that resultant is 4 ohm. So now you have seen in this way you cannot get 4 ohm. Now you connect all in parallel here. You find that R is equal to 2 ohms. First to when you connect all the three resistances in parallel, you get resultant 2 ohms in this way. This is 6, this is 6, this is 6. All the three resistances are in parallel. The resultant is 1 by R. Here you see 1 by R, 1 by 6, 1 by 6, 1 by 6, 3 by 6. So R is equal to 2 ohms. So this value comes 2 ohms. Now you have to get 4 ohms. Here the second question is how you get R is equal to 4 ohms. So now 2 ohms is here. Another figure you have to connect here in the same way. This is 6 ohm, this is 6 ohm, this is 6 ohm. Now, between A and C, this total value is 6, 6, 6. Total is 2 ohms. Now, these two ohms and these two ohms are in series. So R is equal to 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 ohms. This is your second answer. Now,
नाउ सेकेंड क्वेश्चन हैव यू अंडरस्टैंड हैव यू अंडरस्टूड दिस क्वेश्चन नाउ सेकेंड क्वेश्चन वेन टू रेजिस्टेंसेस से आर वन आर टू टू रेजिस्टेंसेस आर वन आर टू कनेक्टेड इन पैरल द रेजल्टेंट इज टू ओम्स एंड वेन दीज आर कनेक्टेड इन सीरीज द रेजल्टेंट इज नाइन ओम्स लेट द रेजिस्टेंसेस भी क्या कह रहा है दियर आर टू रेजिस्टेंसेस आर वन एंड आर टू नंबर वन R is equal to R1 plus R2. This is is equal to nine ohms. And first, this is the second statement. First statement was when it connected in. When it connected in parallel, this is two. Resultant is two ohm. So one by two, one by R is equal to one by R one plus one by R two. Here says R is equal to two. So this is one by two is equal to one by R one plus one by R two. This is first statement. This is second statement. So what is the value of R1? You have to find out the value of R1 and R2. Two resistances are. When you connect them in series, then the resultant is 9 ohm. When you connect them in parallel, then the resultant is 2 ohm. So now use these two equations. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Second equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. Now first equation is equal to R1 plus R2. It is one by two R. आप इसको उलट दीजिए reverse inverse लिख दीजिए R one R two by R one plus R two is equal to two. This is third equation. Now put the value of R one and R two आपको पता है here R one plus R two is equal to nine ohm. तो यहाँ R1 वन प्लस आर टू इज इक्वल टू नाइन ओम लिख दीजिए सो आर वन इंटू आर टू बाई नाइन इज इक्वल टू टू या आर वन आर टू इज इक्वल टू टू मल्टीप्लाइड बाई नाइन इज इक्वल टू एटीन नब दिस इज द फोर्थ इक्वेशन R1 वन मल्टीप्लाइट बाई आर दोनों का गुड़ा मल्टीप्लाइकेशन R1 वन और टू का 18 है अब 18 को आप ऐसे भी लिख सकते हैं जैसे ये है दिस इज बी टू मल्टीप्लाइड बाई नाइन ये ऐसे भी लिख सकते हैं थ्री मल्टीप्लाइड बाई सिक्स थ्री सिक्स या एटीन टू नाइन या एटीन एंड वन मल्टीप्लाइड बाई This R1 multiplied by R2 can be written in three forms. Here, this is R1, this is R2. Here, R1 is equal to two, then R2 is equal to nine. Here, R1 is equal to three, then R2 is equal to six. Here, if R1 is equal to one, then R2 is equal to तो दीज वैल्यूज आर वन आर टू की ये वैल्यूज जो है ये पैरल कॉम्बिनेशन को तो सेटिस्फाई करते हैं लेकिन आपको दोनों स्टेटमेंट देखना है हियर दिस इज ट्रू दिस इज ट्रू फॉर आर वन इज इक्वल टू टू आर टू इज इक्वल टू नाइन For this value R one three R two six this is also true for us this formula for this parallel combination this is also true. But 
these values should satisfy this equation also. R1 plus, plus R2 should be 9. So this middle value R1 is equal to 3, R2 is equal to 6. This value, this one satisfies this one. This one is true for both combinations, parallel and series. So this is your answer. Your answer is R1 is equal to 3 and R2 is equal to 6. This is your answer. Because your answer should satisfy both statements, and both combinations. When connected in series, should give 9 ohm. When connected in parallel, should give resultant 2 ohm. Understand? Let us further proceed. Aage badhe, agle question ke liye. Dhyan se dekhte jaiye, dhyan se padhte jaiye. It will become easy and easy. Aage chal ke bahut aasaan lagne lagega, jab aap practice karte rahenge. Next question. Agla question mein padhta hoon. An 8 ohm register when connected in parallel with X ohm register. Koi unknown register hai X. Usko 8 ohm register ke saath connect kiya jata hai parallel mein. So resultant comes out to be 4.8 ohm. The resultant resistance is 4.8 ohm. Find the value of unknown resistance X. X ki value bana. Kya kah kah raha hai? Question is, 8 ohm register is connected in parallel with X ohm register. The resultant resistance is 4.8 ohm. Find X. Wo unknown resistance kya hai? Let, do resistances hai. R1 is equal to 8 ohm. Given R2 kah raha hai X ohm. Some unknown. Given R kah raha hai 4.8 ohm है. Resultant is 4.8 ohm when when these two are connected in parallel. Then use the parallel formula. 1 by R is equally very simple. 1 by 8 plus 1 by X. This one. This is X. Unknown resistance. Now this is given, this is given, this is R1, now put the value R, R1, so this is 1 by 4.8, 1 by 8, simple mathematics, 1 by X. Now take the numerical value this side, equal to 1 by X, this is I write it easier. And take this 1 by 8 this side. So 1 by 4.8 plus, oh, sorry, minus this side. It becomes this side, becomes minus, minus 1 by 8. Ab kya karenge? Point hata dijiye. Point hata dijiye. So upar 10 ho jayega. It is a 1.8. 1 by 4.8 अब दोनों तरफ 10 by 10 से मल्टीप्लाई कर लीजिए ऊपर भी मल्टीप्लाइड by 10 नीचे भी मल्टीप्लाइड by 10 इतना एंड चेंज रहेगा बट इट विल बिकम 10 by 48 सो so, 10 by 48 minus 1 by 8 एलसीएम 48 48 10 minus 8 6 जब 48 तो 6 this is 1 by x. Now 1 by x is equal to 10 minus 6. 4 by 48. So x is equal to 48 by 4. Oh. Something went wrong. No, it is okay. It is okay. 
इट इज ओके एक्स इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी एट बाई फोर इट विल बिकम ट्वेल्व एक्स इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व ओम दिस इज योर आंसर यू कैन वेरीफाई फ्रॉम हियर इट इज वेरीफाइड This is your answer. X is equal to twelve ohm. बहुत easy mathematics है, easy calculation है. लेकिन आप लोगों को practice करना है. अमेरिका की खूब practice कीजिए, तो आपकी theory, formula सब clear होते जाएंगे. One more question. You are given three resistances: one ohm, two ohm, three ohm. Now you have to connect them in such a way. ऐसे कॉम्बिनेशन बनाना है यू विल गेट नंबर वन दियर आर थ्री रेजिस्टेंसेस आर वन इज इक्वल टू वन आर टू इज इक्वल टू टू एंड आर थ्री इज इक्वल टू थ्री ओम्स नंबर वन हाउ यू कनेक्ट दैट रेजल्टेंट बिकम्स दैट नंबर वन Resultant R is equal to six. Number two, R is equal to six by eleven. And number three, R is equal to one point five. So first of all, try to connect in series. सिंपल वन टू थ्री कनेक्ट इन सीरीज यू विल गेट वन प्लस टू थ्री प्लस थ्री सिक्स वन दिस इज नाउ आर इज इक्वल टू आर वन प्लस आर टू प्लस आर थ्री यू विल गेट सिक्स वन प्लस टू प्लस थ्री सिक्स वन दिस इज अर आंसर कनेक्ट इन सीरीज सेकेंड सिक्स बाई अलेवन Try to connect in parallel all the resistances. One by R is equal to one by R one plus one by R two plus one by R three. Means one by one plus one by two plus one by three. Now take LCM. Six. It just becomes six. This becomes three, and this becomes one. What? What went wrong? One, two, three. One ohm, two ohm, one by two, three. Yes, this becomes two, three, eight, six, eight. Then it will be six three nine or two, six three nine two gara, but a six. So one by r comes gara but a six. R is equal to six by eleven. This is your second answer. Very simple. Now for third combination. Now you use your general knowledge. It is half. It is three. When two resistances, equal resistances, three ohm के दो resistance हैं. If you have three, uh, two resistances of three ohms, you will connect in parallel. The resultant will be half. So any one point five ohm. So this combination suits well. 
ये दो मिलके वन ओम एंड टू ओम आर कनेक्टेड इन सीरीज टू गेट थ्री ओम एंड दिस थ्री ओम इज कनेक्टेड विद दिस थ्री ओम इन पैरल तो यू विल गेट वन पॉइंट फोर फाइव ओम हाफ when equal to equal resistance are connected in parallel resultant is half r by 2 <coughs> you connect them 1 ohm 2 ohm 1 2 iska total ho gaya 3 now you connect in parallel 3 ohm this becomes 3 and this this 3 in parallel so 1 by r equal to 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 in a 2 3 are connected in parallel then resultant is 1.5 up 3 kara 1.4 so this is 2 by 3 so r is equal to 3 by 2 equal to 1.5 जनरल थिंग शुड बी रिमेम्बर कि अगर दो रेजिस्टेंस पैरल में हैं इक्वल वैल्यू के हैं लेट आर तो उनका रिजल्टेंट जो है आर बाई टू होगा पैरल में कनेक्ट करने पर तो ये जनरल आइडिया है आपके पास 